You see the screen darkened for the scenario. A snowplow simulator helps prepare drivers for being out on the road in a variety of different conditions. And the proper plowing speed is between 25 and 35 miles per hour. Chris Cunningham shows us what drivers face during a snowstorm. Use your mirrors and hopefully you can see your yellow line or your white line in that mirror. That, that's why those lines on the road are so nice to have. At the same time, a different monitor provides a different perspective. This is all sidewalk? You're on the wrong side of that mailbox. <laughs> oh, that explains it. Which allows ITD to do an instant replay so drivers can learn from their mistakes. The goal is not to hit this stuff, but if you do, it's a safe environment to do it. This is like I'm over at Horseshoe Bend. I took my turn and I was feeling pretty confident. <laughs> I guess if you can drive a tank, you can drive a plow, yeah. all right? <laughs> Maybe it does correlate. <laughs> but perhaps I need some more practice as I drive down the middle of the road Why and then oh, I hit a patch of ice. Oh! oh. Oh man, don't hire me. <laughs> Driving a plow in winter conditions can be difficult, so ITD asks the public for help. The biggest thing drivers can do is give a plow space. Don't try to pass them, don't rush the plow, just give them space. The plows are big, they're heavy, they can't stop quick, they can't move quick. Don't get mad at your plow for going slow. Steve Dent, six on your side. You're making it safer for everyone.